Hello, my name is Connor Joyce and I'm applying for MA Acting with a preference for the contemporary course. I'll be performing Cassius from Julius Caesar by William Shakespeare and then I'll be performing Nicholas from the Sun by Florian Zeller. I know that virtue to be in you, goddess, as well as I do know your outward favour. Oh, honour is the subject of my story. I cannot tell what you and other men think of this life, but for my single self, I had as lief not be, as live to be in awe of such a thing as I myself. Well, I was born as free as Caesar. So were you. We both have been as well, and we can both endure the winter's cold as well as he. For once, upon a raw and gusty day, the troubled Tiber chafing at its shores, Caesar said to me, Darest thou, Cassius, now leap in with me into the sangry flood and swim to yonder point? Upon the word, accoutred as I was, I plunged in and bade him follow. <laughs> so indeed he did. Bid ere we can arrive at the point proposed. Caesar cried, help me, Cassius, or I sink. And this man is now become a god. And Cassius is a wretched creature who must bend his body. If Caesar carelessly but not on him. He had a fever when he was in Spain. And when that fit was on him, I did mark what he did shake. It is true. This god did shake. I and that tongue of his who made the Romans mark him and write his speeches in their books. Alas, it cried, give me some drink, Titanius, as a sick girl. Ye gods, it doth amaze me a man of such feeble temper should so get the start in the majestic world and bar the palm alone. It was dreadful, man. The worst week of my life. Everyone here sick, anorexics, psychopaths, they're all crazy. They'll talk about dying the whole time. I'm too sensitive for a place like this. Every night I've been afraid. There's no lock on my door. And there's this man that keeps passing to and thro in front of my room and I'm convinced that he's going to return when I'm asleep. There's another one that cries all night. All night, Mum. He doesn't stop for a single minute. I swear, you need to get me out of here. You can't leave me here. It's hell. You, you can't leave me in hell. How do you expect me to get better if I'm surrounded by people who are much sicker than I am? I've thought about it, Tina. And I'm not the same anymore. Trust me, you've grown up all of a sudden. I've understood about things. Things I won't do anymore. What I've understood is that I don't want to finish up in a place like this. It's been like an electric shock. I feel like I can return to normal life. I feel you can go back to school. I feel it, you have to trust me. It's as if I can finally see the end of the tunnel. But, but you have to get me out of here. If you don't, I'm going under.